Now, it's one of the best-loved landscapes in Sussex, the Cookmere Valley, with its meandering river flowing down to the white chalk of Seven Sisters coastline. But it's slowly changing following the Environment Agency's controversial decision to reduce flood defences there. Now, the transformation has inspired a young photographer, Kieran Simpkin, to keep a pictorial record of the changing face of the valley. Robin Gibson has tonight's special report. It's a place of light and colour, breathtaking on a clear day. The issue for a photographer here is not so much where to start as where to stop. For months now, Kieran Simkin has been coming back and back to the Cookmere Valley. Taking thousands of pictures. Yeah, I take literally thousands and it takes me just as long to No one asked him to do it, no one's paying him. And he's not selling anything. It has become a bit of an obsession, um, and uh, now I tend, to, I tend to be here every couple of weeks, depending on the weather. Um, I almost see it as a missed opportunity if, I, if the weather's good and I don't come out. Kieran set himself the goal of recording the changing seasons and the changing landscape of the Cookmere Valley in a time of transition. With reduced sea defences, the meandering river landscape is expected to transform into more of an estuary. It's become a job he feels he has to do. I realised that um, this landscape that I was so familiar with was, wasn't going to be here for much longer, or it was certainly going to change drastically. Um, so, I, as a photographer, I, I sort of see it as my duty to document this landscape and, um, you know, preserve it for history. It's become a mammoth portfolio, which Kieran has made freely available on a dedicated website. I'm out here pretty much every time the sun's out. Um, so yeah, it certainly has taken my life over a bit. An open-ended mission. Kieran says he'll stop when the landscape stops changing. Robin Gibson, BBC Southeast Today, in the Cookmere Valley.